hope you guys had a fantastic New Year's. Um, had a chance to, to make some New Year's resolution and of course break some New Year's resolution. Um, had a chance to kind of have some of you guys hit me up on my Facebook and when I had a chance to talk to some of you and they said, hey, you know, you have a lot of interesting topics and conversations uh, to talk about and so, you know, I said, well, you know, hey, you know, I'll get a chance to that my messages will be very informative. Um, wow. We're going to do a lot of uh, fantastic things here. This is my first time trying this year. So, um, keep it in the way I this year. So anyway, um, hopefully you'll get a chance uh, every month on a monthly basis that I'll get a chance to have some topics or some conversations with you and kind of enlighten you. And so I'm looking for moments of enlightenment. And you know, the only thing that really matters is I want to start out by saying, giving my girl Miss Opal a big uh, shout out for launching her own network. Uh, I found it to be, that, that's the only real TV that I actually kind of watch, and that I really watch it as the time now. Uh, all of this, the other stuff that I see on TV is just really not entertaining to me. Um, the, uh, what is it, the reality show? Is that I'm actually old school, so I want to still drive and hang in my lane where I can swim. You know how that is. So, but, um, what was the show that I thought that I was watching? I started to kind of watch that bullshit that Atlanta House was, and I'm looking at that. And, and I thought it was just repulsive. I'm like, who in the hell feels like this? Um, Kim, please. You know, I think when Miss Patty LaBelle shut you down and said, please drive your own. Don't say. Please don't. Don't even harm. Matter of fact, just, just carry the Usher plate at the church. Thank you, Jesus. Anyway, I'm just kidding. But it, y'all, she's terrible. I swear, I've never seen her doing anything like that bullshit. I've seen drag queens perform uh, wearing a jeans string better. So, yeah, that's just my perspective. Also, for hot topics, uh, what else could I want to discuss? Because uh, periodically, every month, I'm new at this shit, so we're quickly here. You know, as I grow and develop, I believe that if one learns, then one must learn to teach. So, uh, you do you. Until then, So, uh, oh, what was the hot topic? Um, oh, um, oh, I was watching on um, the web, uh, the other day where they were talking about the birds that the creepy shit. The birds just fell out the sky and, and they were flying and uh, excuse me, hello. You know, that would kind of alert me and that's some freaky shit. I've never heard of it and and uh, you know, all I'm saying is just watch because there's some stuff going on. I just hate to see some people start falling out the sky and not, just unexplainable and some mystery bullshit that happens. So, you know, I'm just keeping it real, y'all. I want to keep it boss, keep it 100. What else was there that I wanted to talk about? Oh! Throughout the holiday season, um, on my Facebook page, so I think I received, like, maybe, I, I was, you know, posting pictures all into the holiday season and everything. And I had a chance to, to go take some photographs and, and uh, took my pets and posted their pictures there on uh, Facebook there. And then I started to get like these messages from people that live, you know, uh, people from my past and I guess from my hometown. You know, I can care less, you know, and give less than a damn what you think. I really think that. Uh, I never, uh, I didn't kick it with you like that. I, I really didn't. I, I didn't dig you like that. Uh, I think, um, you know, you do you and I'll do you. Uh, and I think you know who uh, you are. Uh, but uh, yeah, you started giving me uh, the new messages. And let me tell you something. If you're homosexual, you be you. Do what you do best. Uh, God loves you. We're all God's people. We're all created. So, um, and my uh, suggestion is do your research first. Do your research first before you decide to put the finger at people and decide, and, and because according to you, couldn't, 
your your back wasn't strong enough because I guess they vibe be real good so much for so much of what was going on. But um, my walk with, with Christ and the Lord is, is spiritual and more close to and so meaningful to me. So and it's a personal relationship. So I don't think anybody has a a, a, a right to, to uh, describe a relationship or, or, or manipulate your relationship with that walk with the, the man upstairs. So, Okay, moving right along. What else? You know, I want to actually every month to bring you monthly vlogs and kind of see where we can actually take this to kind of enlighten you. Um, we can have hot topics, conversation. Um, oh, I want to give a shout out to my girl, Miss Cadillac Kimley. Much love in the ATL, y'all. Uh, I tell you, the sister is on it. Um, I think she's she's dynamic. Um, she, she she's 100. She's ball shot. You know, she, she uh, carries her own. Um, very articulate. So I want to cover the get a chance to cover the floor here and, and kind of keep it real and, and just let you know, uh, you know how I get it. Um, and, uh, what else was there? Oh. Um, I wanted to also. Did you? Were you guys watching? Did you guys on the line? And I saw something that came on on uh, television, and uh, that was kind of strange. Some bullshit that happened um, with um, the. I think it's the NBA housewives or basketball wives, and and I'm like, damn, is, do we really have anything that's really on TV that's worthwhile looking at, uh, other than a bunch of groupies and the club kids and. Bubba gum ass music on. I was in the record store the other day and I'm looking around and I'm like, damn, who the hell is this? I don't know who this is, you know. Um, I'm just old school. I'm just keeping my shit real. You know, it's some shit that I'm still getting used to, so hey, that's just how it is. That's just how I get down, how I roll. Uh, but uh, I'm always one for welcoming opportunities and, and one that's uh, 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 looking for opportunities to where uh, I can kind of enlighten you as well as myself. So, but, uh, what else was there I wanted to talk about? Uh, oh, there's a new store out at the Mall of Millennium. Make sure you get a chance to check the store out. I forget the name of the store. You know, not that I'm getting some shout outs and getting some uh, free uh, publicity here for the store. But, uh, awesome store. If you thinking about uh, redecorating your house or doing some uh, uh, purchasing accessories or whatever, but I suggest that you get a chance. To, it's the only one. It's actually right around the corner from um, as you're entering the mall from the, the, the main entry. I can't think of the name right off. Anyway, that's okay. That's okay. Um, but anyway, like I said before, hopefully every month I will get a chance to give you a, 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 a shout out, be informative. Uh, provide you with information, spiritual, uh, prayer, <laughs> definitely believe in prayer, uh, the dynamics of that, uh, and spiritual thoughts with you guys. Uh, so I look forward to it, and I hope you guys uh, really enjoy uh, January with uh, having uh, conquering thoughts and, and peace, serenity, and, and all the wonderful things that life has to offer. Until then, 